It's a beautiful morning here and check out the new additions to the collection. I'm really excited to go through some of these and share them with you. And I'm even more excited that we have some supporters of our channel that are so kind they give us things like this. So wow, I have a lot of gratitude and a lot of excitement. So let me go show you what we have. So the four of those are Peruvian Apple Cacti, which I find interesting because some have longer spines than others. I'm still looking for the truly spineless one. I've seen it before. And then on the left here is an Echinopsis Schick Hybrids. They make really beautiful flowers. And now these, now the Selenoceris that's red just needs to be re-rooted. Re but there's a Selenoceris Vegans, a Selenoceris Doncalarii, I can't remember offhand. This one could be Selenoceris spingulosis. And then this one I'm really excited about. It kind of looked like a bunch of turtle heads. And this is Selenoceris testudo. So really stunning variety of Selenoceris. I'm excited to see a flower in the future. Now here's that red one you can see. It needed to be re-rooted. Re and over here are some Hyloceris costarosensis. So now I have that variety added to my collection. And let's go check out these now. So this is an unknown variety. It's very beautiful. If you can give me a hint in the comments, to, or a lead, I guess, would be better. Let me know. It's rather petite. Now one of these two is native to the Coronado Island or islands and in the Baja. I can't remember which one. I want to say the one on the left. And this one's just really spiny, but really beautiful and colorful. And then here is a Puntia Violacea. I really like the color, the violet color. The spines are larger than I thought it would be too. So Puntia Violacea. So this is a really beautiful blue-colored cactus. I'm really excited about this one. And if I remember right, it had two names, and he called this one a Pyloceris palmarii, I want to say. I called it an old man cactus, but he said there's several old men cactus, so I need to know the proper name for this one. It's really beautiful. And this one is a bluish tint as well. And I have the name written down. But I cannot remember it offhand, I'm sorry. I think it had azure in the name. So you can see it's very blue up top here, and the new growth is really stunning. And then over there, these two, the one on the left is unknown, and the one on the right, he had a huge collection of a cluster, and it was probably my favorite cacti he had in the yard, and it is a Stenoceres hybrid, if I remember correctly. And then yesterday, I went to my friend's dragon fruit farm and collected some beautiful cuttings here and some fruit as well. So you can see that these cuttings are rather large and they're just basically American Beauty, Maria Rosa, uh, Sugar Dragon, and some unknown ones I'm really excited about. So there you go. Give us a like and a subscribe. We'll keep you updated on these in the future and wow I sure do like all of these beautiful beautiful plants all right thanks for watching